Uh, I've been here 11 months. I'll be here a year, April 14th this year. And uh, I mean, it really ain't, like, cause I've been locked up before, you know, but this is my longest I've ever been locked up away from my family. So like, you know what I mean? I'm kind of like, you know, motor like, you know what I mean? Trying to really do what I gotta do so I come home. But I mean, I like, I didn't see like, you know what I mean? A lot of people like murder, you feel me? People were like, you know what I mean? A lot of high crimes, like a lot of time. And like, I just think, thank God every day that you feel me? That I got the time that I got, you know what I mean? Because like, I'm only 18. And so, you know what I mean? I got a lot ahead of me when I come home. So I just thank God every day that you feel me? I'll be able to got the, the blessed opportunity just to be, you know what I mean? The time I got, you know, cause I wouldn't know what to do if I had, you know what I mean? 30, 50, 40 years, so. How many years did they sentence you to? They only gave me three years. So, I mean. And what are you in for? Robbery. So, you're 18 and you've been here a year, then you must be transitioning out at some point. Yeah, too. I'm supposed to be transitioning out too. I just uh, just got my GED and I just in my uh, I just got done completing my thinking for a change class. So, I'm trying to do what I got to do to come home. So, everything been going smooth for me. Do you know when you when you get transferred where you're going? I know that Aurelius said he's going to IYC. Yeah, I probably want to play on the field too. You're IYC, going? yeah. So. Do you know anything about IYC? No, I'm just <laughs> new to everything. So just when I get there, I know what's going on. So. So do you guys talk to each other about? I didn't know um, that you know you're both looking at transferring. I didn't know you were 18. Uh -huh. um, do you guys talk to each other about what this transfer stuff is going to be like? Yeah, we talk about all the time. We, uh, we sit here and, like, you know, like, ask each other when we leave and stuff like that, how it's going to be, you know, and, and like, and like, like what is going to be and how it's going to be when we get there, you know, because everything, like, I can say everything new for both of us. You know what I'm saying? We know what's ahead of us, what, what is it bringing us or nothing. We just letting it go by our goal, you know what I'm saying, just trying to get home. So, um, what's it gonna be like being separated from each other? I mean, do you feel like you're good friends? Tell me how you're feeling about that. Yeah, it's gonna feel different to be with somebody else. You know what I mean? Since I've been with bros for a long time, since we got locked up, so it's gonna feel different. But like I tell you, you know, we gotta, you mean, it is what it is, we gotta get used to it. You know, if we wanna go home, you know, we have to, you know what I mean? We probably gonna be with each other forever, so. Therefore, you know, I mean, we have to get used to it, and you know, I mean, wherever he go, wherever I go, we still gonna do the same thing, still hold it down for each other. So, just gonna have to, you know, I mean, get used to it, and when we get home, you feel me? That's what really counts, you know. What I mean, as long as he all right, I'm all right. So, yeah, yeah it'd be all right. Because, um, actually, you know, what I'm saying, me and me and Mike Stanley been um been bunky since since the, since the county, you know. Then he left before I left to come here. Cause I didn't know I was coming here, you know what I'm saying? And he gave me his number and all that while I was in the county. And when I got out, I was gonna call his mom with, ask, uh, um, what's, what's his address and what's, you know what I'm saying? Because really, you know what I'm saying? I, I, you know what I'm saying? I wanted to know what was up with him, you know what I'm saying? Because we were so, we was buggies in the county, then he switched here. And then when I got here, you know what I'm saying? We both got in the same room with each other again. And ever since then, we've been in the same room. And, and now, and now I'm saying I'm I'm about to leave anytime, you know, and I won't, you know what I'm saying, him to, you know what I'm saying, when I leave, you know what I'm saying, like I told him I'm gonna write him, you know what I'm saying, see how he doing, see is everything cool and all that, you know what I'm saying? Just just add, you know what I'm saying, to keep in touch with him. And then when we get out, you know what I'm saying, that's when we can really be with each other because he ain't tell you who, you know what I'm saying, he hoop, you know what I'm saying, he play basketball, he real, he good or whatever. And when he get out, he gonna try to go to a little, little college, you know what I'm saying? Build build himself back up and get it, try to get a career and, and hooping. So there's a possibility you could both be transferred to the same place. Yes, ma'am. But, but they don't tell you ahead of time where you're going? Why do you, you but you think you're going to IMC? No, we, we signed paperwork. Well, first they asked us where we want to go, you feel me? So we signed a paper that we want to go to, to from certain facility. Then we get like probably like a week or two later, we get approved if we want if they accept us. And so we both had you feel me got approved. So you know what I mean, but he got approved before me. So I don't know if really the same time or they can get him first and see approved. But I don't know. So. But you think you're leaving first? Yes, ma'am. You know. I've been 18 the longest, and I've been approved since December. And I can leave any time now. Are you nervous for it? I mean. I am, but I'm not because I know where he going. He going. He going to make sure everything cool. But 
I just want him to do everything I do so he can come home, you know what I mean? Cause I just don't want to, you feel me, just be, well, I know I got to do what I got to do to go home for myself, you know what I mean? But I want to make sure everything, you feel me, if I got to help him, whatever he got to do, to, you know what I mean, to get a time court or to pass this test, to get a time court or whatever, I'm willing to help him, you know what I mean? But, you know what I mean, I, I ain't going to say I'm nervous for him, but I just want the best for him, so. Are you nervous for him? <laughs> Nah, I ain't, I ain't know for him. I said, I already know that he going to hold his ground, say to himself, and get home. Like, I don't want to get home to his family, you know? And I know that his head on straight. When he was out there, like I said, he hit with the bad crowd. I did too. And now we both know what's the bad crowd. So we want to try to make the best. So when we get out, on we're going to be hanging with each other and our families, you know what I'm saying? If we stay out of trouble, all the bad stuff behind us, we ain't going to look back. And we're going to keep it pushing, you know what I'm saying? and try to try to move on and just keep them bad people away, you know what I'm saying? Teach little people, his, 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 his little brother and family, keep my little brother and family, tell them how it is and tell them it ain't right. I don't want y'all to come and I'll do anything I can to keep out of here, you know what I'm saying? Keep out of trouble, locked up, period, you know? Do you have, um, do, you, do you sit and think through your mind what being in the adult facility is going to be like? Have you thought thought that through at all? every day but i mean i'm really not like you know how some people base how we in here off like movies or what they see out on the outside but it really ain't like that but i mean i'm open mind i'm really do you feel me like when i go there you know I me mean? if i do go to the dog facility i'm not gonna change any different be scared or you know what i mean Low, lower myself a thing i'm just gonna do me regardless you know what i mean so hopefully you feel me though does respect that you know that he ain't in here trying to act too hard or trying to play that role i'm just gonna you know be myself and you know what i mean just do what i have to do you know what i mean i ain't gonna worry about what they doing over there or getting involved in this crowd or none of that i'm just you feel me just gonna stay to myself hopefully if bro in there with me you know we chill do what we have to do you know what i mean because most of our family know each other you feel me so everything play a sport, do, do what we got to do, so I ain't really worried about it. Do you feel like since you've been here, have you been able to see anything with general population or anything here? Does that help prepare you, do you think? Or? Yeah, I mean, I talked to some, I know some people. Well, before I came here, I knew some people. You know, when I got here, I talked to some people. Hey, I mean, everything, I mean, you know you're going to get the people in blocks that want to fight and probably got a lot of time and really don't care about other people. And, you know what I mean, really, I'm I'm just a, you feel me, a people's person. Like, I get along with everybody, you know what I mean? I catch on myself very quickly, so I'll be able to know, you know what I mean, who, what's what's going on, so one don't really get past me. But some of my people um, said that, um, some people told me about IYC. I think um, some of my people been to IYC, and they said that's the, um, that prison cool, you know, and everybody, it's everybody ready to get out, everybody ready to the time to get out of IYC. Ain't nobody in there, like you said, some people want to, don't care about that time ready to fight and all that stuff, but some people say IYC, most people say IYC is the best prison to go to because they got more time cuts, and most people in there is old school and ready to get out and don't got, don't got time for that bull, you know, and want to just move on, you know what I'm saying, got time for the little youngsters, but they said mostly people being there fighting as the youngsters, trying to get their rep up and stuff like that, but if you come in there cool, I heard they respect you, and they help you out, you know what I'm saying, and they'll show you what's this, what's that, and how you lost in there, and just keep on your P's and Q's and just be by yourself. Any final words you want to say, Michael? Um, anything you'd want people on the outside to know as you, A, spend time here, and B, you know, look at serving time in an adult? Mm, I say, you know what I mean? Like, really, I don't wish nobody bad on nobody. I wish nobody would have to ever get locked up, but I mean, people do what they do, so all they can do is learn from what they've done, but I mean, I'm just going to say, next time you see me, y'all got to see me, y'all interview me, is going to be out there somewhere positive, though, for sure, best believe that.
guys get to take these uh, these containers? Yeah, we have to take them with us. As they call property boxes, you put your commissary and stuff in here. Nah, that. I think what else do I have? 